Hello everyone and welcome to Braid. Um, I had to kind of re-record my voice over this because I was a complete idiot and forgot to check if my mic was unplugged in properly, so yeah. I always seem to forget to do that sometimes and yeah, kind of, it's what happens. So, um, it's kind of lucky that this video is kind of short, only like about 17 minutes long. Yeah, I did about an hour and 40 minutes of recording, but yeah. Yeah, I did do, I was able to find um, some other pieces on here. Uh, um, this wasn't like one of the pieces, but I found that um, there was that little platform there. Don't know if I actually found that before, but yeah, I saw that. I was like, okay, don't remember that being there before. <laughs> so yeah, this was um, one of the puzzles that I got. I don't know why I didn't see it before. Okay, yeah, I can, as you can see, like right there, there's that platform that is moving. Don't know why I didn't notice that before, but yeah. <laughs> yeah I was basically just playing around, just trying to get, um, or trying to jump on those guys to see if I could get across, but yeah, found out that <laughs> it was, um, yeah, <laughs> that platform was able to move, so yeah. I actually just noticed that there was that, um, thing going up. I'd probably meant to use the, um, time to be able to use that but <laughs> okay um oh yeah this one was with the key basically um i was trying to save on a little dude down below me and basically i well, i should stop trying to use my hands to explain because you guys can't see me but yeah it's kind of hard trying to save this guy from the um plant things yeah basically there's a key over in the corner so I think he got it, but yeah, there should be. A, yeah, you can see that he's got it there. So basically, there was like a sound that happened when he got it. So yeah, basically, <laughs> that one was kind of easy as well. Don't know why I didn't <laughs> see that one. Yeah, just need to wait for those because it was kind of hard to try and wait for those because those were unaffected by time. Yeah, basically the key was right next to where that door is in that little cubby there. Okay, and get the piece. <laughs> that was yeah, another easy one. <laughs> I hate those stupid rabbits. <laughs> They're so annoying. Okay, this one is kind of similar to the last one. It's just the key and the cubby there, and you have to try and save the guy from not getting bitten by plant things. Basically, I found that um, it can go really fast with that cloud down there, so basically he used the hat, so yeah, it was kind of easy. I was spending ages on this one trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, so yeah, um, actually kind of forgot about this, um, basically, um, I didn't realise that there were certain doors that you had to put it in. Because, yeah, of course, um, in this area, it's like, yeah, the time moves with you, so, yeah, basically, um, I couldn't put in that door, because otherwise the key would move away from it, so, yeah, of course I had to go to this door. Okay, I know um, there's another area which has the same mechanics where... And to go to the opposite tour, but it's really hard to try and figure out. Oh yeah, this one. <laughs> I was spending ages on this one because I think I was here for at least a good 15 minutes trying to actually get this. Cause yeah, I knew what to do, but it's just a matter of trying to actually get it to work. Cause yeah, it's a matter of trying to get out that second ladder there. 
he had to basically try and get the guy across and try and get in front of him, then get up the ladder or get to the ladder before him. <laughs> yeah, that was really hard. Yeah, basically in this next part, I just um, moved all the pieces into the proper places. Okay, so this next one, I um, kind of figured out how to do this one because you can slow down the time on this one. So basically on this little one here, I had to slow down one of them so I could actually jump across. But yeah, I had to get a ring back so I could like get the next one. Yeah, this one was kind of tricky because you had to be spot on with your jumping. My nose won't stop running either. Okay, of course it's winter here, so I may or may not be coming down with a cold. <laughs> so yeah, I did try this other second part over here, but yeah, it was kind of hard. Okay, this next part, um, I was just kind of playing around and it took me quite a while to figure out. See, so, yeah, I realised that um, little part that I was staying on, um, it protects me from a reversing of time so basically I found out that um, the ring it will like travel back in time that so yeah I figured that um, I could actually put 
the ring um, back over to where that key is and then um, go back and yeah, use that little place there without me trying to be killed first. So, you basically have to put the ring there, then go back in time, so. Yeah, like, some of these are actually really easier than I thought. But yeah, this just shows how really bad I am at puzzle games, so. Yeah. Basically, I just had a little trouble with this part, because, yeah, the stupid fireballs are really annoying. So basically I just need to stand on that and yeah, turn back time. I always thought I screwed up the hill and the key fell, but yeah, because I forgot first time. I just need to wait. Let's take a while to go back, but yeah, because I had to do it slowly because I didn't want to like miss my chance. the key so yeah basically I had to go back down and make sure that I could actually get in time and it slowly falls but of course I was an idiot and I forgot to grab my ring because yeah I didn't realize that I would need to be able to get back up to the um up the ladder thing it wasn't until I got there that Realised, oh, I forgot my ring. <laughs> so yeah, I was there trying to get, find a way to get my ring without dying. <laughs> so yeah, basically I figured I had to reverse time. It should be any second now. <clears throat> yeah, I was just trying to get my ring through there, but and then I realised that I should probably just reverse time and get that back that way. <laughs> so this was kind of tricky, I had to grab the key and the ring. Yeah, I'm able to get it, so yeah, that was good. <clears throat> Excuse me while I'm losing my voice slowly. I seem to do that every time I record, I seem to almost lose my voice. So yeah, that was kind of another easy one. I was able to get the piece there. But yeah, I decided to play around with this area's puzzle pieces because yeah, I managed to get a few of those. Okay, basically on this part, um, what area was this one? Um, this was area 5, I think. Yeah, this was area 5. I decided to go back through this one. But yeah, I ended up discovering this one. This one was another easy one. Don't know why I didn't bother to do this one, but yeah. Figured that, um, because this one you have your double self, so... <clears throat> um, I realised that, um, yeah, you could do that one first and then go back around. And like go through that door because yeah I had to jump on that one to be able to get across but yeah now I can get that piece over there so yeah that basically gets that door open for me so then I can actually get back out so yeah I can actually <clears throat> go and get this piece
and then I decided to go through and play around with this one a little bit more. Yeah, I still didn't know where that piece went. <laughs> I just need to find a few more. Oh no, that one actually went there. Okay. So, yeah, I don't think I found a spot for that one. Because, <laughs> yeah, I need to go a few more pieces left. <clears throat> Okay, this one was another easy one. This was in uh, one of the layers. I think this was... Yeah, this was also in Area 5. Because, yeah, this one was kind of easy. <laughs> Just a matter of trying to reverse back in time and try not to get killed by those little guys. Because those were annoying. Because they kept on killing me. So yeah, basically this one was easier to go back all the way through so I can get that little trap open so I can actually get that piece. So yeah, I basically went around a bit more but um, I think that was the last of the puzzles I did. So yeah, I basically just um, went back through all my things there and yeah, just played around. Make sure that the, all the pieces were in order. I think that may have been actually the only one that I did because yeah that was the only piece I got extra so yeah basically this is the end of the video then <laughs> so yeah I'll probably try and get all the pieces in next area because yeah I'm pretty sure I have to <clears throat> get all of them to be able to like get up to next area because yeah it seems like you can see the uh, ladder there has uh, uh, different um, colours there. Okay, yeah, basically I'm guessing that once I complete each area, like the ladder moves across or something, so. Yeah, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this Let's Play, and I'll see you guys next time.